Hello, hello. Welcome to another episode in my Race to Grandmaster series. And it looks like we're going to be going in fourth position here. So wheat is looking pretty scarce. And which means that ore wheat sheep would not be ideal as a play on this board. All right, I'm liking this uh, 310 8 over here though. So that's a, that's a possibility for us. Let's see. Nine five nine five ten. Where is the okay? The wheat port's over here, or not wheat port? The wood port. Hmm. Try to figure out if we could get this, and then maybe we could get. Wow, there's not a lot of good spots here. I'm not seeing any breakout spots or strategies that we could play. Maybe you guys are looking at this board and just thinking like, "Oh, it's so obvious. You should totally be playing this on this board," but. I'm just looking here and I was like, wow, this, this is trash. <laughs> um, but let's see. All right, let's take a closer look here. Taking some time to analyze. I mean, if I want highest production, I'll probably go for this 9510 uh, right here. 9510. Yeah, man. I'm trying to think if even anything on the outside would be wise to take. Let's see here. Hmm. Wow. There's like nothing that I could really do. Let's see. If I take six, eleven, four, branch down here, go for the three for one, maybe. Then we wouldn't have wheat. Hmm. Do I want to go for this four, eleven, nine? and have the best uh, wheat production on this board. I mean, maybe. I know I said that I probably wouldn't be playing or wheat sheep, but it could, could happen. Let's see if we just, <sighs> I'm not liking this. If we take this, how will we get brick? We'll have to trade for brick. My man, I, <sighs> I feel like I had to take the highest production spot here. Okay, the ore is up here. Ore spot, so maybe we'll make our way up there somehow. Um, maybe sitting up would be a good, a viable option for us if we take this. Or maybe we have to go for something that will give us a little bit of sheep intake. But we could always trade wheat and get the other resources we need. So maybe our training gear will be much stronger uh, for this match. But relying on trades, that's gonna be pretty pretty annoying. If I take the spot, I'll have to focus up on trying to city up as soon as I can. And then from there, maybe branch out to try getting some wood, or not wood, brick and sheep. Because we'll already be on track for seating up if we take this second. And like I said, we'll control uh, wheat. <sighs> wow. Yeah, I don't know. For me, this is such a tough board. I don't know if I'm just like blanking because my, my brain is dead right now, but maybe I should go for this. All right, nope. Let's do it. Let's do it. Go this way. Come on quickly. All right, go. All right. We're taking these two spots. I know... <laughs> This, these are very questionable placements to, to take at the moment, but man, I, I didn't see any better uh, option where we were at. Then again, I could have tried playing for uh, sheep since we are pointing towards uh, the sheep port. So maybe I should have tried getting some sheep intake, but just a single uh, six for sheep. I mean, that's still not a lot of production to solely rely on uh, the sheep port. I mean, we obviously could make our way up here if nobody takes it, but let's see a green. Yeah, green does not have sheep, so I could see them taking this. Um, let's see, where else could they go? They have good brick. Yeah, I mean, this probably is ideal for green. Oh, okay, so they went out that way. That is an interesting route to take. So they're going to be playing this without sheep. Gray needs sheep, so okay, that makes a lot of sense for them. Uh, this spot, this A3 is still open, assuming that green won't be going for it, but likely they will. And they have good brick and um, wood production here. So, yikes. Okay, let's see what we could do. 
on this board. Another thing we could consider is just break, branching down down here, going for this 810. Seven is ruled by green. So who are they trying to take from? They're stealing an ore from us, which is really going to hurt our uh, early city strategy here, unfortunately. Five is ruled. We're going to get a wood for five. So uh, I did play one match that I decided not to upload just because there's a lot of like delay and like lull moments in between um, turns. Did end up losing that match just due to uh, poor placement and... I was taking a look at my uh, account details on this account and it said that I only played uh, I think 23 games like before this match and this match is episode 26 I believe so there's missing games somehow I'm not sure why that is but I started this series because I got to Grandmaster oh they stole from us um, in 73 games so I'm trying to beat that 73 uh, record you're trying to trade. I mean, wood isn't going to do anything for us, so yeah, we'll we'll do that trade there. We need our wheat and ore to be able to city this up. So yeah, we're willing to make that sacrifice. Uh, do we need sheep for anything? We currently don't need sheep, so I'm not going to help them out anymore. I'm a little bit confused as to why they just built that road there, because I'm pretty sure that's what they just did. Yeah. Eight is rolled, we get nothing for eight. But yeah, uh, for some reason I'm missing like two matches on this account. I'm not sure why. No, we, we will need brick. Okay, yeah, we'll do that. Oh wait, oh, I, it must have, he must have canceled before I was able to accept. Seven is rolled by red. So, so far we were robbed twice. Uh, this match twice out of, what, they, three, two out of three times unfortunately so we're a little setback okay so people are starting to target other people at this point which is going to be nice for us we need a nine to hit four okay so now we have a wheat that we are able to trade i'm curious to see hmm we could go up here and try taking that eight three because right now going for the wheat port would be kind of pointless. We could go for the three for one. I mean, that, that might make a lot of sense right now. So let's try trading off one of these uh, wheats right now. See if anyone's willing to take it. Okay. So green's willing to do it. Let's do that. And we'll go for the three for one since we do have decent production for wood. And we don't need all that wood. So 12 is rolled. Nobody gets anything for 12 currently. So yeah, uh, this series will end when I reach Grandmaster or if I hit uh, 73 games without getting to the Grandmaster rank. In which case, then uh, I'll start another series back on my main account uh, and we'll try to rise up the ELO rankings uh, similar to some of the other Catan channels out there currently. And I feel like it'll be better. I mean, when you're in like the platinum or under uh, rankings, people don't seem to care as much. I mean, I, I see a lot of people quitting out and I feel like in the grandmaster uh, rankings, maybe people don't, don't quit out as frequently. I mean, I could be wrong. Uh, I haven't played that many games in the grandmaster ELO. Uh, so I could just be making a wrong uh, assumption there. Okay, so 11 was rolled. We got a wheat for that. We still, there, I don't think there's been a nine rolled. Okay, yep. Nine has been rolled zero times out of 10 currently. Uh, so after we get this three for one, five is rolled. Okay, so we get another wood. Um, we need to figure out a way we could get brick and sheep to be able to place this settlement. I mean, I, I don't think this was a horrible placement. I mean, we did uh, what we could with what we had, I think, so. Uh, six is rolled. We get nothing for six currently. Hmm. Let's try. Let's try this. Let's see if someone will counter uh, offering one of those. Uh, if someone accepts giving both, I mean, that'd be fantastic. But I'm just looking for one of them. Nobody. Okay. Well, let's try this. I mean, guarantee somebody has to have sheep that they don't necessarily need. I mean, I would assume, but. 
Okay, no from everyone. All right. Uh, should we try one more? Now, I, I don't want to like piss people off by making too many trade offers because at that at some point people are just like, oh no, we're not gonna trade with this guy. He's being super super annoying about it. So I'll just um, end my turn quickly there. Eight is rolled. We get nothing for eight. Okay, wood for sheep. We do have. Okay, we'll we'll make that work. Make that work, and then we could try trading something for brick. Okay, so now we have to be careful how much we're going to be assisting uh, Gray with trades uh, moving forward since they're currently in the lead. I mean, I don't think they're in that strong of a position, but no, can't do it for you, man. Okay, yeah, so they're going out there. We won't, doesn't look good that we'll get this at 8 3 position there. Nine is rolled. Nice. Okay, so we get two or there. Okay, so we need nine to be rolled one more time, or maybe somebody is willing to trade us for a single or. Let's see. Nine is rolled again. Nice. Okay, so that, that's huge. Okay, so we'll drop the settlement here so we could get more wheat since wheat is so low on this board. And we need to trade to make things happen, so we'll place it there. Do we want to buy a dev card? I think we'll wait on uh, the dev cards for right now. Um, just until I can secure this 3 for 1 and then maybe go out and get this uh, sheep spot. That way all we'll have to really worry about is just trading for brick. Uh, no. Don't have brick currently. I mean, it would be really cool if we get advanced down here, get this 8, 8, 10. I would like the 8, 10, and then maybe going for the 6 deuce up here. But kind of hard to do without brick. Okay, nice. 11 is roll. We'll get some more wheat for that. Sheep for ore. Nope, don't really need to do that currently. So if we get another 9 roll, we could just city up this spot again. Or this spot here, not again. I haven't already city that spot up. So I'd like to take this time again to thank you guys so much for all the support you have given to uh, this YouTube channel. The views have been awesome. Comments have been awesome. Uh, if you guys haven't already, be sure to hit that subscribe button because that number has been steadily going up. And if I could ever get to like 100,000 subscribers at any point in my life, that's a dream. That is a dream for me. Uh, Let's see. Mm. I, I don't want to buy a card because we don't have uh, any way to get sheep. So let's try this so we can get a brick just to hold on to until our next uh, wood roll so that we can get that three for one port. I mean, we haven't attempted a trade in a while, so I figured might as well just uh, shoot the shot. However, it is not looking good. We'll give him one, two. Okay. Just move along. I don't want to make people mad at me and you know not be willing to trade. Nice, nine is rolled, so we get some more ore. Okay, so after we city this spot up, uh, we could start doing uh, four for one trades using ore uh, to get the resources that we don't currently have. Now we could branch out just one road and then get the sheep port, but I might want to try extending it to two roads to get the eight ten. I mean, just to be able to. Uh, get some production with eights would be fabulous. Let's see. You want if you give me those two things, then yeah, I'll give you. I'll give you an ore. Okay. <laughs> Not willing to do a two for one trade. I get it. Makes sense. Eight is rolled. We get currently get nothing for eight. We just have to try, or we just have to hope that we could just hold on to the resources that we have. Let's see if we had to ditch four. Yeah, we wouldn't wouldn't have enough. Currently. Let's see, eight is rolled again. Oh my goodness. Wish we had something on eight. Yeah, actually going for this uh eight three, uh seeing green going for that eight three might be better for us, so we don't have to waste more resources to go up there because I mean late game break isn't gonna help us out that much. Uh let's go ten. Okay. Get a wood for that now hmm let's see let's try to oh wait i will need i would need that okay 
Let's just try this. See if anyone wants to make that trade. Someone has to have a decent amount of brick, right? Well, then again, the eight brick is blocked. It has been blocked for a while, actually. Uh, red never responds, so I'm just gonna just move along here and just uh, city this spot up. And again, we're just gonna continue to wait uh, until someone offers up a brick, or if we have enough resources to do a fourth one trade. Nice. Okay, seven was rolled here, uh, not before my turn, luckily. Okay, so this is things are going well for us currently. Uh, we'll see how things pan out for us once uh, people start having more uh, production. I'm really surprised that Gray didn't attempt to rob me there. Four wood for a green uh, done by Gray. Nine is rolled. Nice. We're going to get a lot of ore. Uh, now we're going to be able to do that four for one trade and get a brick, assuming that we're keeping all of our resources, which hopefully we will. Seven is rolled. I just, yeah, I shouldn't have said that. All right, let's ditch that. We don't need those currently. I mean, if another nine is rolled at when it's my turn, that'd be great. Oh, they stole a wood from us. Okay, that's not good. Hmm. Yeah, we, we really need that three for one to make things work. So I'm just going to hold on. Until then. Okay, red is taking a little bit. Okay, let us roll. Uh, what do we need? Well, can't really do much no matter what's rolled here. Four. Okay, we got some more uh, wheat. Hmm. Let's try going for wheat for brick again. Doesn't work out, doesn't work out. Negative, negative, and red doesn't reply, so we're just going to move along. Four is rolled. Nice. Okay. So if we could somehow get either a 10 or 5 uh, to be rolled, then we could do 4 for 1 trade, get the 3 for 1, and then. Mm, or if you give me a brick, give me a brick, I can make it work. Come on, Gray. You have to have a brick, right? Yeah, you're on a five. And fives, eh, fives have been rolled three times. I'm not going to trade for a resource that I could get myself at this point. Because what is Gray trying to do? Gray. Mm, I mean, that would help me. That would help me. I'll get the wood I need. I feel like I could do better. I feel like I could do better. I'm just going to wait. Because uh, I don't want to help him city up here. To increase his production. He'll probably city this spot up. Okay, they just bought a dev card. Decided they want, didn't want to uh, seven out or risk uh, sevening out. Nine is rolled. We would have gotten a lot of ore. Hmm. Sheep for wheat? No. Okay, so like I said... 10 or 5 to be rolled the next two turn would be ideal. Okay, yeah, they got that settlement up there. Which, the only thing it does for them is give them a little bit of sheep production, so I'm not super concerned. 6 is rolled, nothing for 6. Hmm. Okay, red has another side. Okay, so we're really concerned about red. They got two cities and one... Uh, settlement here and they got the three for one spot their production is decent they got a six and an eight yeah i could see them uh taking this one maybe we'll take second place because you know, production for green and gray not great wow they just bought two devs okay let's roll here we get 10 okay so now we could do that trade we we're talking about Let's see. Well, let's just see if anyone wants to give us brick so we get a little bit cheaper. I, it doesn't look like it. So, all right, let's just do this. Now we have that and we'll just, uh, get our turn here. Okay. How many do we need? One, two, three, and yeah, we need three roads to go up here. I mean, it's, it's totally possible. Totally possible. Three roads go up there. 
and we'll probably drop a city up there if we can after the settlement you know phase obviously night card is played by gray and they decided to rob who'd you rob you robbed red okay nice yeah let's keep going with that i like it i like that strategy so worst comes to worst if we need to throw a quick uh, settlement westboro road here uh settlement there nine nice getting four uh or so we could use that to do a three for one trade make our way up here because after we after we get some sheep intake i mean it wouldn't be a bad idea at that point to start stacking some devs so we'll do that top priority now going up here to get the six six deuce and after we build there we can start buying devs in addition to making our way down here for the 810 or just going straight straight up just for the 10 depending on what cards we have roll we get a 10 nice getting some more uh, wood here okay so we could well does anyone want to trade for brick what are people looking for red's actually responding now okay no one wants to do any trading with us currently so we'll do that so we can build two roads okay one two all right let's get up there i mean i guess gray could cut us off but i really don't see it being very beneficial to them to cut us off just to go for the three uh three for one spot since they're already on the six sheep that being said they could do it just to be a jerk in which case we'll just go down here uh nope they need a brick so maybe they can't do it maybe they could only just build one road here and then just be stuck i hope i hope please nobody trade him which i i don't see a lot of people currently holding brick let's see 11 11 is rolled twice five oh my goodness they're doing it all right we're racing gray any opportunity we get to attack someone we're attacking them uh 10 is rolled get some wood for that so we we need need uh to get brick somehow or to get enough resources to trade hopefully hopefully a nine will be rolled at some point here we need that spot eight is rolled we get nothing for eight okay somebody is holding brick okay we need to figure out what they need for brick unless a nine is rolled here come on nine or five would work as well nine yes okay there it is wow got super lucky there all right let's do this trade go up nice can't cut us off anymore and hmm do i want i guess we'll do a trade and just hold brick and wood for right now just to prepare for that settlement that that's a uh, fantastic move there. I'm really happy we were able to get up there. Nice four is rolled. We get some wheat. So decent amount of luck there to be able to do that. Man, really glad. Really glad that worked out. So that'll put us in a really good position because now um, we could also be contender for longest road. Go up here and then make our way down. Something that we could do. We're currently sitting at four roads as our longest. Eight is rolled. We got nothing for eight. Let's see here. Who else could go for longest? I guess green could go for longest as well. Ooh. Yes. No, wait, wait. Oh, wait. I thought that was sheep. I don't know what I'm doing. I, I'm an idiot. Yeah, I'm an idiot. I shouldn't have done that. Dang. Well, now I have... Uh, Brick to trade, you know, for sheep, maybe. Oh, wait, I don't need to. I could do a three for one trade. I saw it and I thought it was sheep. I got excited and I clicked. <laughs> that, that's what happened there. Uh, my brain read it as sheep, even though there was a picture of a brick there. So good, good job, brain. Way to, way to make a fool out of me. Red's buying devs. Okay, let's roll. We get a six. We get nothing for six currently. Let's do that uh, three for one trade. Get the sheep. Okay, so now we have sheep intake. Sitting at six victory points. We need one more road for longest. That'll put us at eight. 
and we could build one road down here and then all we had to do after that is uh build a city and then we could we could take this it's very very possible i mean like i said in the beginning i was very skeptical <laughs> uh just due to our placements but we we might make this work uh nope not gonna be trading anything now just gonna hold that brick so that we could uh build a road okay so gray is sitting at four roads currently 10 is rolled we get some wood for that i mean gray is going to easily be able to take longest road away from you at any point uh and it's a little bit scary because once i take longest road people will see eight victory points but all right we got to target this guy no matter what let's just hit his nine repeatedly so my orange take is gonna go out the window that's all right i have a decent amount of wood production that we could rely on to do uh three for one trades so not super concerned the fact that wheat is so low on this board is definitely hurting a lot of people so overall i'm, I'm kind of glad that we did go for this uh 1149 in the beginning okay what is green doing okay train brick for green see yeah i, I don't like it when people do that we we'll just hit them with the clock emoji yeah, people have I mean obviously unless you're doing it every single turn and then at the end of your turn you're not making any moves then I could see how it could be justified oh no reds attacking us they stole a brick from us or a wood from us eight is rolled get nothing for that as we suspected the nine is going to be blocked for us uh, constantly uh, since we currently are in the lead and we're probably going to take an even bigger lead once we get longest road but Gray will take it away from us with their 9 5 uh, wood brick combo there. So we have to debate do we want to take it or do we want Gray on the same level as us? And they'll show six victory points so they could target both of us. Yeah, we'll see. If all we have is this, might as well take longest road. But then again, we make ourselves such a huge target. Oh, okay. Where are you going, Red? You're going for this 810, aren't you? Okay, we might have to just build down here, actually, just to get the sheep uh, port. I mean, we don't need it, but I'd rather us have it than Red, because, yeah, they have so much production for sheep if a 4 is rolled. So we're actually going to build down instead of getting longest road for right now because like i said gray could easily take it away from us and i'd rather just both of us show six victory points right now just because uh i'm just going to repeatedly be targeted uh deuce is ruled nice we get sh a sheep for that okay so all i need is brick and wheat brick and wheat to get the settlement i mean maybe if we have enough resources would i'd prefer eight ten uh, over just the 10 but we'll see we'll see what resources we have gray has 10 10 cards currently uh okay going up there going for the other six makes a lot of sense okay so they took longest road like we thought they would a four is rolled we get some wheat for four Hmm. What do they get? Oh my goodness, they just got, what, five? Five sheep? <laughs> so all they're holding is sheep currently in their hand. Oh my goodness, I'm talking about red, because I saw the fours rolled. I was like, ooh. Night cards play, they're probably gonna try robbing. Oh, they did not rob us, okay. If we're going for the same spot, I thought it made a lot of sense to rob us, but, hmm. Okay, so they got sheep, a bunch of sheep, some wheat, and whatever card they stole from. Who'd they steal from? Uh, gray. And gray. Uh oh, yep, they're going down. They don't have enough resources to build. All right, we need we need five or ten to do this. So let's go. Three. Oh no. Oh no. What do people want for brick? Hmm. I'd be willing to do for a two for one, 100%. Offer up the trade. 
to wood for a brick to green. I'm willing to do it. Okay. Yeah, let's do it. Uh, this, this is just huge for us so that we could block off uh, red. So that's why we definitely needed that to happen. So another good thing that worked out in our favor there, uh, even though we were losing out in that trade, but just to block them off, good for us. And, you know, we obviously don't get the eight uh, or spot, but that's fine. Mm, wheat for brick. Uh, I don't want to make that trade right now because I don't know what our next uh, move is going to be. But I see ourselves building down here, maybe getting the deuce five. Maybe. Um, but yeah, other than that, uh, we'll start sitting up here. And like I said, I do want to start buying dev cards. I also do want to make the six deuce a city so we can get, increase our sheep production. So that's a lot of things that we could do. Six, we get, uh, oh yeah, we get sheep for six. Wheat for a road. Hmm. Wheat for a road. All right, green. You know, I'm a little afraid of their production currently. Oh, okay. Red and green are just move, moving along. Where are you? Oh. Oh, my goodness. They did it. They did it to them. Wow. Okay. Wait. Somebody took longest road. Okay, they took longest road to wait. No. Oh, because they cut them off. Then it was went down to four. Now red took it because they have six. Okay. I was a little confused there for a second. Okay, so red took longest road. Yeah, we're not going to be helping you out, red. Now, I don't understand why. Well, I have seven victory points too, I guess. I have seven victory points. They're one away from largest army. They have two dev cards sitting there. So I assume once they take large army, they'll probably take this victory. They bought another dev card. Hmm. I have to try taking longest road away from them, but I don't. Nine. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. How could we do this? What's the smartest move? Obviously, we're at least going to buy a dev card. Nothing else. Hmm. Let's see. Does anyone want to trade for a wheat? You could do a city instead of a dev. Uh, not looking good. And yeah, red probably not going to help us. Okay. Uh, in which case, dev car is the only thing we could do. Road building? Ah, oh, it's a knight. Okay. And our turn there. Three is rolled. We get nothing for three. Yeah, it's not looking good. Not looking good first. Well, at least we'll get second place. Uh, I don't, well, I don't see green making a lot of big moves here. Unless what they could do is take away longest road. If they just build two roads here, they'll connect. They'll be at eight. They'll be back down to five. I mean, that, I might prefer green to take longest road actually for right now. <laughs> so let's see what they decide to do. If they take longest road, they'll be at eight, back down to five, and then they take largest army, they'll be back at seven. So it'll be a real close game. Eight, nothing for eight. Okay. Hmm. So I to branch out that way. I mean, oh, night card. Yep, they take largest army. They're at nine, maybe 10. Yep, they're at 10. All right, well, we got to second place, which I'm pretty happy with overall, you know, considering our initial placements and a lot of luck was on our side there. Um, we did, however, go down a couple ELO points, so we're back down to uh, 1080, unfortunately. All right, so let's see what we're up against. Uh, we we're up against, oh, gold took it. Okay, wow. Okay, I just got outplayed, totally outplayed. Um. Let's see here. Take a look at these numbers here. Eight was the hero. Six, you know, was not. Got beat out two nines. Okay. So 50, 58 turns. Game ended there. I mean, I still feel all right about our initial placements. I really don't see how 
with the options that we had left, uh, what what else we could have taken. But let me know in the comments, like uh, what would you guys have picked? And uh, if you enjoyed this episode, be sure to hit that like button and I'll see you guys later.